A rapid development in online education through online coursework has been one of the most apparent trends in higher education over the past years. Despite the grueling challenges of the pandemic, bringing our lives to a halt, the power of technology made access to education much easier and convenient. But one thing remains clear, learning never stops. Good morning to our clinical instructors, fellow nursing students, and College of Nursing community. We are the Group 2A from BM3D, and we would like to present to you our poster of our nursing research entitled, Lived Experience to Online Assessment Nursing Students' Perspective. Nursing education has been traditionally taught in face-to-face -face lectures, but with the surge of the COVID-19 pandemic, numerous academic institutions that were previously resistant to changing their teaching and learning practices now have no choice but to adapt to online teaching and learning in its entirety. The purpose of this study was to explore the nursing students' perception towards online assessment. For the research design, this study utilized a descriptive qualitative type of research with a phenomenological approach. The participants of the study were six nursing students of University of St. LaSalle, Bacolod. The participants chosen for the study met the inclusion criteria such as the participant must be willing to partake in the study, the participant must be 20 to 21 years old, the participant must have experienced nursing education in both traditional setting and online setting as they will have a more thorough comparison that will satisfy the research problem, must be a regular third-year nursing student in academic year 2021 to 2022 and currently enrolled in University of St. LaSalle Bacolod in academic year 2021 to 2022. For the research instrument, an in-depth interview guide was used to gather necessary data. For the results, the five thematic insights that were created based on the lived experiences of the participants with corresponding sub-themes are the following. For theme 1, technical difficulties, under sub-theme A, unstable internet connectivity, the significant statement reads, and I quote, disadvantage ang poor Wi-Fi git because once mag-disconnect ka, do kabudlay gin magbalik, especially sa mga quizzes, end of quote. Under sub-theme B, faulty device condition, the significant statement reads, and I quote, there are times that I experience an unresponsive screen, so I tend to lock and unlock it again, end of quote. And under sub-theme C, lights out, the significant statement reads, and I quote, the biggest factor is the brownout because you need to fully charge all of your gadgets in case there would be an unexpected or sudden electricity interruption, end of quote. For theme 2, new normal advantages under sub-theme A, accessible and flexible platform, the first significant statement reads, and I quote, very accessible and available, you can go anywhere, kag pwede ka lang ka-answer quizzes, end of quote. Under sub-team B, convenient and easy to use resources, the second significant statement reads an I quote, I do not need to go to school to take the quiz. Instead, in just one click, I can access the site easily, end of quote. Under sub-team C, efficient study time, the third significant statement reads an I quote, your quiz can be two days from now, ginhatag siya, or maybe next week, or maybe next meeting, which is next next week, end of quote. Under sub-team D, increased quality time at home, the four significant statement reads an I quote, the fact na ari ka lang sa balay, makapanghimus man ko di, kay kailangan man daan bulig ko sa balay, end of quote. For the theme three, mental and physical consequences. Under self-theme may evolution, the first significant statement reads an I quote, kailangan siyang face-to-face kid di para maka-exert dayon sa motivation, compared nga nagapong ko lang ko di, kailan tao kang kamati, daw ka ka po igid, end of quote. Under sub theme B, poor concentration, the second significant statement reads in I quote, it would be divided attention, meaning a lack of focus because, of course, not all of the nursing students have a quiet room to answer the quiz. End of quote. Under sub theme C, anxiety, the third significant statement reads in I quote, there is a lingering fear of being incompetent in the future due to lack of exposure both to the community and the hospital. End of quote. Under sub-theme D, prolonged screen exposure, the fourth significant statement reads, and I quote, the other one disadvantage is monotony induced by increased exposure to the screen as well as sitting at the same spot for a prolonged hour. End of quote. Under sub-theme E, limited time allotment, the fifth significant statement reads, and I quote, there is a time limit in digging the test and you need to be time conscious at the same time the teachers give us the only short period of time. End of quote. 
For theme four, influence a student's learning experience under the sub theme of difficulty in internalizing lectures. The first significant statement reads, and I quote, Paano tama internalize at ang mga natunan? Paano to karama further enhance ang ating skills? End of quote. Under the sub theme of test of learners' integrity, the second significant statement reads, and I quote, Online testing at first was kind of weird in some way because you see well at the professor, it was a test for integrity for us students. Yeah, end of quote. Under the sub theme of less effective in students' evaluation, the third significant statement reads, and I quote, my thoughts of regarding the online testing in the nursing education program is not effective in terms of evaluating the capacity of the students. End of quote. For Team 5, New Learning Experience, under sub team A, First Hand Experience, the first significant statement reads, and I quote, Manol Gidea sa online testing, for example, mga first few quizzes and all honesty Gidea, pag first nga open sang quizzes, first thing dayon is nagchat ko sa friends ko. End of quote. Under subtim B, new challenge, the second significant statement reads, and I quote, as a nursing student, I mean, online testing is a new concept to me, despite us living in the advent of technology, end of quote. Lastly, under subtim C, innovative assessment tool, the third significant statement reads, and I quote, helps me retain the lessons and important information, especially pwede ta siya daan mabalik-balikan ng aton mga lessons, kung mabal ang tabala, kung di in tabala nagsala, end of quote. In conclusion, regardless of the efficacy of online testing, the challenges outweigh the benefits as the benefits are mainly focused on the student-nurses' work environment However, the challenges highlighted the long-term influence of online testing to the students' learning experience, mental and physical well-being, and enhancing their skills towards their future career as nurses. The researchers strongly recommend educators to create more effective policies in the implementation of online testing, providing a concrete guide for students on what is expected of them in the duration of the test, and effective monitoring strategies for students by taking tests or exams to further improve learners' testing integrity. And these are the references used in our study. And that ends our presentation. We hope you enjoyed it and thank you so much for listening.